Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. When you want to send an email message to someone, you can do it from your inbox folder. To do this, first open the inbox folder. Then if using Outlook 2013 through 2010, click the new email button that appears in the new button group on the home tab of the ribbon. If you're using Outlook 2007, click the New Mail Message button that appears in the standard toolbar. In either version, you can also press Ctrl plus N on your keyboard. Doing any one of these actions will create a new blank message and display it within a new message window. From here, you can enter the recipient's email address into the To field. You can enter the email address of anyone who needs a copy of this message into the CC field. If desired, you can use the Select Names dialog box to insert names from your contacts folder or from any other available address book. To do this, click either the To or the CC buttons within the email to launch the Select Names dialog box. In this dialog box, you can click the Address Book drop-down to select the desired contacts folder or address book to look inside for the addresses that you need. Once you've selected the correct address book, you will then select the name of the person that you want to email from the list shown, and then click the associated button, either To, CC, or BCC, to add them into the list box at the right for that type of recipient. If you send an email to someone and place their email address into the To field, it will be sent to that recipient. If you place their address into the CC field, they will receive a copy, but you are indicating that it's only a courtesy copy. If you place their address into the BCC field, that person will also receive a copy, and the persons listed in the To and CC fields won't know that the person in the BCC field also received a copy. Once you have properly set up the addresses of this message, you can click the OK button to return to the message window. Next, enter a subject for the email into the subject field. Then click into the body of the email message and type the main text that you want the email to indicate. Now when you're ready to send your message to the selected recipients, just click the send button within the message window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.